What's up guys? So uh, tonight was Super Bowl Sunday and of course the Patriots won. We were honorary Falcons fans tonight so we were rooting for Atlanta. Um, but I mentioned earlier today on Facebook that I would make a video about what to do if it's Super Bowl Sunday and you want to stay on plan but you still kind of want to indulge. Um, so if you had a spread like what we did, and I'll show it to you here. So my suggestion to you is to, um, if you're right-handed, then to carry your plate in your right hand and serve with your left. Or if you're left-handed, then carry the plate and serve with your right. Or normally you would serve with your dominant hand and you might take you know, a bigger spoonful or, or two scoops or something like that. But what I find is that if I use my left hand, I get a smaller amount because I'm not ambidextrous. I can't really use my left hand for much. Um, so I figure spooning food uh, onto my plate as a smaller serving size than what I would if I used my dominant hand. Um, also, you guys probably saw the cookie cake that was in the uh, shot. Um, I just asked my sister-in-law to cut me a teeny tiny little piece, so I still got the flavor of it. I just didn't go all out and have a, you know, a giant piece of the cookie. Um, so that's my idea. That's You guys can do whatever you want to do. Whatever helps you stay on track, that's what helps me. Um, same like if you go to a big family dinner or church gathering or if you go to um, Golden Corral, you can do the same thing. You use your non-dominant hand and you might serve yourself less. I don't know. There's ambidextrous people in the world. They might do the same amount no matter what they do. Um, also, tomorrow's Motivation Monday. So last week we talked or we thought about what, what we use to motivate us. What um, what motivates us to do the, the things we do or, or make the changes that we're making? Some of you said um, your kids, some said your spouse, you know, everybody has a different answer. So I guess for Motivation Monday, now that we've thought about what it is that we want to motivate ourselves with or be better for, um, now this week let's think and talk about how we can put those things into action. So if your kids are your motivation, what can you do for an hour a week just to get started with your kids that are going to bring you a healthier lifestyle? Um, that's all I have. So I will see you guys Wednesday on Way In Wednesday. Thanks. Bye.